Hi, Dustin Lee here from Retro Supply, and in this video I want to teach you how to create your own foil textures easily in Photoshop without any tools other than Photoshop. So here's how we do it. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to our foreground and background colors and we're going to choose two colors, and this is going to be the colors of our foil. So we're going to want a light and a dark color. So we're going to go for a classic gold foil. So I'll pick a pretty saturated but light yellow. And then I'll switch it here. And I'm going to choose a dark color. And I'm going to get a gold color, but a much darker gold color. Like say that. OK. Now that we have the two colors, I'm going to create a new layer. And then I'm going to go to Filter, Render, Clouds. And as you can see, we have this kind of cloudy, um, dark and light gold color. And this is going to be the base for what we're doing. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to go to Filter, Noise, and we're going to Add Noise. And this is optional, but I like to do this. It gives, it, it gives the gold kind of a more realistic look. And we're just going to t get a very small amount, say 7% monochromatic noise on top. Press OK. And then the last thing we need to do is just go to Filter, Filter Gallery, and then you're going to choose Distort, Glass, and you're going to, I'd probably bring the distortion to about 20. Adjust the smoothness, and you can see it on the left hand side here, what it's doing. You can adjust the smoothness for a more smooth gold foil look, like that, or a much rougher gold foil look. I'm going to choose a smoother one. I have the texture on Frosted and the scaling at 100%. As you can see, you can adjust the scaling and tweak this until you have it exactly how you want it. Press OK, and we have a gold foil effect. It's that easy, and you can use this gold foil effect to add to um, your text or whatever. And here's a really quick way that you can add it to text. So I'm going to make a new layer, create text, click on top of it, get a larger font here, and I'm going to choose Hatton Darling, which is a really cool new font that came out, and just write foil. I'm going to adjust the size and make it bigger. And then we put the gold foil on top of it, and here's the trick to it. We're going to go to Layer, Create Clipping Mask, and just like that, we have text with a foil effect on top of it. I hope you found this useful, and if you want a really advanced version that gives you tons of real foils made from real source material as well as digital foils, sets it all up for you with textures, it makes it super easy to use. Um, go ahead and grab Retro Supplies Hot Foil Kit. Uh, it's really useful. I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. I will talk to you soon.